Hi everyone, my name is Cleomi Palmas. I'm a grade 11 homeschool student at their homeschool global. And today, as a young person who is passionate about technology, I believe that we have the power to change the world and make a difference in our communities. In this talk, I will discuss ways to inspire and encourage young people to pursue careers in tech and strategies for supporting and nurturing their development. Today, I am thrilled to be here to talk to you about empowering the next generation of tech leaders and ways to inspire and encourage young people to pursue careers in tech and strategies for supporting and nurturing their development. <clears throat> Section one, why tech needs to be taught to the younger generation in school. Careers have changed drastically. Many jobs back then only needed specialized skills associated with their trade, so you could get a job if you just had a major and it was associated with your trade, you would immediately get that job. But a study from the European Commission showed that an organization's performance was low because their workforce lacked the digital, the digital skills to keep up. And tech-related or not, studies show that most jobs will require tech knowledge to excel in the future. And the constant, evolving world now needs the next generation to have a certain degree of tech knowledge to pursue and excel in their careers. Introduction to, the tech sparks curiosity. <clears throat> Introduction to tech sparks curiosity and innovation. And having an interest in tech inspires students to ask questions and formulate solutions as well as develop a passion for exploring. Younger generations grew up with tech and can easily work with the flow of the digital trends and catch up with the evolution of technology. Compared to older generations who would have a little bit of a problem with catching up with the constantly evolving state of technology, younger generations have the advantage to catch up and, <clears throat> and work with the flow of the digital trends easily. Okay, so instead of the going of the flow of how things are done, a student with a tech background is more likely to think about how they could use tech to make impro improvements to old systems. Exposure teaches determination. Learning about tech or how to use technology as a learning method re helps reinforce the idea of not giving up early. Kids learning new skills like programming languages and how to use apps like editing softwares will learn to see the value of persevering towards a milestone. Why tech needs to be taught again. Tech equips students with the skills that they can use, utilize in the future. And having a tech-related hobby increases a child's chances of getting into college. According to Princeton Review, the importance of hobbies helps students improve their college, help their college applications stand out. And with a tech hobby, a student can pursue a tech career or other career that values their skills. Learning to make online portfolios and resumes can increase the exposure of a student and showcase their achievements and projects. And tech clubs, such as coding clubs, and teach students to work both, to both work hard and to develop both hard and soft skills by interacting with others through their craft. Section two, tackling the challenge that it's too late to develop tech skills. Despite being inter interested in tech careers, some teens and people in their, tw in their early 20s think that it's too late to look for a tech-related career or join the industry. A poll by Finsbury Glover Herring showed that a group of 2,000 people aged between 16 and 26 across the United Kingdom, the United States, Germany, and China re revealed that 46% of the students in the United Kingdom said that they felt that it was too late to pursue tech because they weren't given the chance to study tech-related subjects in school. And those who felt that jobs requiring tech skills aren't available, achievable for them say that tech careers require too much technical skills and training. But with the right mindset, it's not too late. The fear of being too late is also fueled by the common misconception that in order to land a tech job, you need to be a techie and have a tech or science related degree to succeed in tech. Is that right? Wrong. You don't have to be a computer science major to land a career in tech. And many coders worldwide didn't even come from a tech background. 
YouTube is a great resource along with dozens of free courses and resources online that anyone can access at any age and at any time to develop and sharpen various skills, various tech skills that can help them up their game or even land a tech-related job if they wish to. The barrier to entry is intimidating, but wait, if anyone can learn any skill if they know how to look for it. Sorry. The barrier to entry is intimidating, but with tech, anyone can learn any skill if they know how and where to look for it. And learning how to efficiently research on the internet is a tech skill in itself. So in conclusion, we need to strive to provide young people, especially in schools, with the resources and programs that support the learning of tech skills, which they can later apply to grow in their studies and their careers and improve the lives of others. By bringing this vision into reality and equipping young people with the tech skills to navigate the constantly evolving world, we will create a future where anyone can succeed, regardless of their age and background. And that is how we empower the next generation of tech leaders. Thank you.